Hey, what's up guys? Today I'm going to show you how to install a voice meter banana. But before we get into it, could you please uh, like, comment and subscribe if this helps you. I'm trying to get a thousand subscribers, so that will help me out a load. So let's get into this tutorial. What we're going to want to do is make our way over to the VB Audio software website and the URL is here. I'll also post it in the um, description. Once you're on here, please, well, make sure you're on the banana, not voice me. There is a couple versions of this. Banana is the one which has uh, got more settings and a lot um, more customizable. Once you've done that, scroll down. There's two downloads here, the exe and a zip file package. Just press the exe, it's a lot faster. Install that. Um, as you can see, it'll come at the bottom here or go to your downloads folder. Once you've done that, just execute it. So double click it and run through all the settings and uh, the download paths that you need to do and once you've done that you should have the voice meter banana exe here which you'll be able to click and open it up so we have our hardware inputs our virtual inputs and our hardware outputs the inputs will be your microphone so we're going to choose mme for this pretty much works on any computer and, and any audio um, interface that's why we're picking mme for this tutorial uh, and then you want to pick your output, which will be your headset. So use MME again, and there's my headset, which is the Cloud Flight. Once you've, so done, you've done that, that. oh, oh, sorry. If you put um, A1, then you won't get a, a loop back, as you just seen. Um, but yeah, let's go to the top right at the menu. You want to press uh, Run on Setup. If you don't have a blue tick here. You want to click that so pretty much voice meter banana will load up straight away when you start your pc i also advise you to save your settings um later on and you can load them back up if you need to but they should auto um automatically load up on startup okay so now we're going to want to set these as our output and input devices on windows so it'll work with your discord um, communication and your in-game sounds so it all lines up correctly so you want to go over to the settings here which is open sound settings at the bottom right just right click this and uh, if you don't see these options on the right you just maximize it and they should pop up go to the sound control panel and here we can see our um, playback and recording devices so the playback is going to want to be your headset so we'll click this make sure it has a green tick and press set default if you haven't already and we want to do the same with the recording scroll down and click voice meter output and set that as your default great now that's all done it's time to go on to the special effects that you could do in voice meter now these are really annoying so please don't abuse them when you're in game or anything but um, as you can see, if I click anywhere on here, depending on where it is, it can give me more bass on my microphone or um, sound like I'm a Stuart S on a uh, airplane, which is the top right, I believe. But here we go. If you click the A1, you'll be able to hear your voice. I'm not going to do it because it'll echo, but you probably want to do this when you set it up. Um, but as you can hear, yeah, annoying, right? We also, if you right click this, you can go to your, well, I don't actually know what this does, but um, I'm pretty sure it makes like really wavy. Um, so yeah, I can't hear it right. And right click again, position, it'll be like more on the right ear or be more on the left ear. Really annoying. So yep, there's the special effects for voice meter banana. And if you were wondering how you eliminate like keyboard sounds like I got a really loud keyboard um, you want to this will be the right one here the gate you want to turn this up until um, you might want to like keep pressing your space bars pretty much the loudest key on the uh, keyboard until you cannot hear the clicking sound or this bar move up and down So there's mine 7.1 and you won't be able to hear my discord uh not discord you won't be able to hear my voice uh my keyboard oh my goodness can't speak you won't be able to hear my keyboard when i type now um so yeah it's different for everyone's mic but yeah you can change that and this is um your gain so you can 
turn this down or high um, double click it to reset and that is pretty much voice me a banana in a nutshell if you want any more tutorials on VB uh, voice me a banana just let me know in the comments like I said please like uh, and subscribe and I'll see you guys later